wheat wheat Ritz crackers though. Yeah, but that ain't the same shit. Hi, welcome to Church Chicken. Yes, I like the two piece, um, in original, uh, with the mashed potatoes for two sixty nine. Yeah, but I like I like two thighs instead of a leg and a thigh. Yeah. Okay. Anything to drink? Um, no. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Did you think I was bullshitting? <laughs> Shit, let me go. Nigga, don't nobody want no motherfucking. Nigga, you that whole wheat bread eating motherfucker, nigga. I don't want none of that type of old shit. Y'all, Jody in my ear. She always be on some Richard Simmons shit. Nigga, I don't want no, I don't want all that kind of shit. No, 291. Okay. Yeah, she be on some old Stop the Insanity shit. Half the, most days of the week shit. Uh-uh. Yeah, this nigga right here. My motherfucking partner, though. Thank you. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now I gotta be talking shit. Ain't that a nigga? Nigga, I'm finna pull over up under a tree, nigga, and lock in on this uh these thighs right here. That guy. Shit. I'm going to show y'all what I'm working with as soon as I'm able to park. Shit. God. No, I don't eat the breast. I don't like breast. That shit be dry like motherfucker. Shit, I like, yeah, run run me the thigh, not the leg. Because what I do to my chicken, you ready for this, nigga? Make sure the glue and shit is, is, is down on the, around the lace. Nigga, I like... The crispy part of the chicken. I pull that off and that's what I eat. I don't eat the meat. I eat the crispy. Oh, okay. You see what I'm talking about? She said I'm on some bullshit. Oh, okay. I'm on some bullshit then, dog. Yeah, I don't like all that shit. I like, I like, yeah. Y'all, she in my ear talking a gang of shit. This how we talk to one another. So don't be, don't take it personal and shit. Y'all don't understand. This nigga be on my bumper. On my ass. Nigga, whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, she be talking shit to me. You know what I'm saying? That's my motherfucking partner, though. Shit. Y'all, there's a motherfucking city trends right here. Y'all want to see? Okay, there's a city trends right there in the cut. And there's another steady brother. This right here is the hood. These is like some little project type shits right here. Based on your motherfucking income, shit. Bring in your CA7, your motherfucking award letter, and nigga, you winning. Okay, we gonna just take a percentage amount of your motherfucking check. That's what that means. Shit, I ain't mad at none of that shit. Shit, nigga. Yeah, I ain't mad at none of that shit. But y'all, hold up. There's another thing I want to talk to y'all niggas about. Um, <laughs> what's the <laughs> what's the problem, dog? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I wasn't even supposed to say that. Okay, excuse me, YouTube. You know, my girls in my motherfucking ear telling me I guess I wasn't supposed to say that. I done said it now, nigga, shit. You know, I mean, this is just... <laughs> okay. Yeah, I didn't mean to say it like that. I It just fell out my mouth. Ain't shit I could do after that, shit. Fuck it. Oh, okay. I wasn't supposed to say that either, nigga. Oh, okay. My motherfucking ear, boy, kind of let me out. Yeah. But, um, how about Proposition 36 pass? I know y'all want to know, um, what's Proposition 36? Proposition 36 is 
Shit, nigga, that's my brother's uh, get out of jail free card. Do not pass go. Do not um, get. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, nigga, am I wrong for that shit too, nigga? I'm just telling you how the fuck it is, shit. Yeah, that's the uh, get out of jail free. Um, but on that note, though, I think they do get them niggas about $200 and kick them out and shit. Take them niggas right to the, uh oh, there's a dog in the street. They get him about two hundred dollars, and they um put him on a bus, and they uh drop him off in their county, wherever they from. And so, my brother called me Tuesday morning. That nigga was to, making sure um nigga make sure the lines and shit, make sure the chads and shit is all pushed in right. Make sure you darken it real good. Make sure, you know, you check the appropriate box. Make sure the wording is this and that and all that shit. Because bros down here and the chicks too that I guess got a few strikes. Um, they are letting them out of jail because the three strikes law has been now eradicated. So... It's getting ready to be a barbecue going on a, 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 on in the hood at about every uh, three or four houses. Niggas is finna be barbecuing. Um, my brown partners on the other end, they finna have pinatas and shit hanging off of trees. Motherfuckers is finna party, you understand me? Because um, the three strikes have been eradicated. And so now here in the state of California, nigga, it's getting ready to get real raggedy because uh, all these niggas is going home. So my question to my brother was, okay, nigga, where is you going, dog? I mean, okay, now you been in there. My brother is a career felon. True story, okay? My brother is a career motherfucking felon. He got 45 to life. They get ready to let this nigga out. Now, he been in there now for about 13, 14 years now. He missed the, 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 the death of my parents. He, you know, didn't go make it to the funeral. We wasn't getting that nigga out. And, you know, you had to pay for that shit to have them niggas in chains and shit to come. So we was like, you know what, nigga, you done done too much. You might try to run a twist in. So it was like, you know, we might as well go and let you, we'll send you obituary and all that other shit. But nigga, um, no. So, he's getting ready to get out. Family, I don't know what's going to happen. Family, I don't know. I don't know. So I asked him the other day, I was like, okay, but what you going to do? He was like, well, y'all ready for this? My brother told me. Well, um, I'm going to get at Diane. I don't really want her like that. I used to fuck with her daughter, but shit, she on a nigga bumper. So, uh, I'm going to go head on and um, do that thing to that thing and move into her house. And so, and I'm like looking at the phone like, nigga, please, for real? Are you serious? So, um, public service announcement. To all of the single chicks out here in California, you better have your trunk tight. Because these niggas is getting out. And by any means motherfucking necessary, they trying to move into y'all spots. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, but on some real shit, I mean, where can they go? Because it's like, nigga, if you've been doing wrong half your motherfucking life, you have no work history. You know, you can't really do too much but sell dope. You know, and gang bang. You know, my brother is an old school ass crip. I mean, one of them. Nigga, I mean, how are you still cripping and your hairline ain't even together? Nigga, what's going on? Sit that shit. Oh, 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 okay. I'm wrong for that shit too, nigga. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, I mean, nigga, it should be a protocol to gangbanging, nigga. I mean, you know, nigga, when you start getting rheumatoid arthritis, nigga, I mean, who ass can you really whoop? I mean, I'm just saying. You know, because my brother, he's still on some gangbanging shit, nigga. Nigga, um, you is a Himalaya player. I mean, how you still gonna gangbang, nigga, and, um, all they gotta do is push you down, nigga. It's gonna take you a minute to get up. I mean, what's going on? 
So, needless to say, my 50, 51, 52-year-old brother is getting ready to get out of jail. He going to tell me, uh, I want a homecoming party. I said, damn, nigga. He was like, yeah, I want shit. I want chili and all that. You know, he like my mama's homemade chili and shit. This nigga said, I want chili beans and ham hocks. I want cornbread. I want ribs. I want this. I said, damn, nigga, you want some hometown buffet shit. Because you mixing shit together that don't go together. This nigga said he want barbecue and beans. Not baked beans, nigga. This nigga want the ham hock, the pintos. You understand me? This nigga said, I want tacos the next day. I said, oh, my God. I don't even know how we're going to work out any of that. But I hope Diane got that because too many grown motherfuckers can't live in one house together. Now, I'll be damned if I'm going to be coming out of my room and my brother scratching his nuts on my couch. That ain't going down. Now, nigga, I will put you down in a day's end and pay for a couple of nights of stay. Okay, because if I put you in an apartment, at least got to be signed, nigga. And I ain't finna put my John Hancock on some shit. And I know you ain't really, you know, nigga, you can't make the next month. So it's like, okay, so where do they go? And you got to factor that shit in. Because these niggas right now, they getting ready to get out. And they're getting ready to get real wrong out here in California. Now, I feel bad that, you know, he's in his predicament and situation or whatever, you know, he claiming, you know, all motherfuckers have done been in jail. They always saying it wasn't me, the other nigga did it. So, it's like, okay, so they got me trumped up wrong. I was in the wrong place at the wrong time and let me tell you though, let me tell you, this ain't the way it happened. This ain't how it was. Okay, nigga. Irregardless, nigga, after he hit the gavel down, your shit said guilty and um, sentencing on the such and such date of blah, blah, blah. So, nigga, means that basically a uh, 90% chance, nigga, you did it. So, now you want everybody to congregate around your ass and, you know, put money on the books and shit. This nigga even had a nerve to tell me he won $50 by the 10th. And he want me to put this shit, nigga, you can even put money and shit on these niggas' books through the cell phone. On some old, he was like, okay, well, um, I can't think of the name of the shit he told me. He said, you go online, you give my information, this nigga gave me the website and all that shit. Now, nigga, you in there, first of all, my brother is so pimping, he got two goddamn cell phones, you understand me? Now... You know, uh, y'all don't know my brother's name because I know somebody going to be on some old, well, you know, you're going to get your brother in trouble. Y'all don't know my motherfucking brother's name. So it's like, okay, how am I getting anybody in trouble with y'all don't know his name? You feel me? So my brother got cell phones in there, you know, and, you know, he do what he do, you know? And it's like, but you're going to tell me you want, you know, um, you want me to run you $50 you know, because he won't, he won't, he, he talking about, I want some desserts for Thanksgiving. Now, you know, Diane, she already plugging me in on this right here. But if you can get me a $50, you know, get down for the commissary or whatever, the canteen or however, whatever they called it. Um, you know, that'll get me my cakes and, you know, my different things that I want or whatever. So, I helped that nigga get a couple of Dolly Madisons, you know what I'm saying? And whatever, you know, it's, it's, you know what I'm saying? Little, <laughs> help that nigga get a couple little Debbies or whatever. You know what I'm saying? No problem. You hear me, nigga? Yeah, you know they be on them little Debbies and shit, making spreads and shit. And yeah, I help him get him some little shit. And it's no problem, you know. But they getting ready to get out, ladies. And y'all motherfuckers need to be ready. You better have your priorities together. Because these niggas is by any means necessary. There's no criteria to the bitches that they trying to pull, you ain't got to look like nothing. You ain't got to have nothing. But some Section 8. That's all them niggas is looking for nowadays. They ain't looking for all that nigga. If you got Section 8 housing, you winning. Lisa Ray and all them motherfuckers ain't got shit going on. But the bitches that got Section 8 right now. Here in California, nigga, you winning with that nigga. That, do you understand that nigga? That's like some Willy Wonka, uh, that's like that Willy Wonka candy wrapper shit. Nigga, yeah. Mm-hmm. And it's going down, family. Let me order my goddamn tea. Excuse me. Hold on. Damn. Hold on. 
smell fucking sign off. Hi, I'll get to McDonald's if you'd like to try our cheddar bacon onion sandwich today. No, not today. I did have it last night and it was good too. Okay, what can I get for <laughs> I would like a large sweet tea. That's it. Okay, why not? Thank you. Uh, Alright, thank you. Yeah, y'all. Y'all look real good at trying that CBO. Let me show you. See it up there? CBO. That's the shit. I don't know what the chicken one tastes like. The chicken one is probably fire too. Hold on, let me show y'all. Okay, the CBO right there. I've already ordered, thank you. Uh oh, wait a minute. The goddamn sandwich. Oh shit, dog. The sandwich is 790 goddamn calories. The chicken sandwich is from 480 to 630. God damn, dog. That sandwich is nearly 800 calories. Oh my goodness. And then if you make it a meal, which is $2.20 more, you tack on 380 to 620 calories on top of the 790, nigga. Nigga, you talking about gotta go and sit in a sauna, nigga, and take a nap, nigga. You shit, you got to yeah, shit, nigga, you got to do some shit like that, there. Shit. Uh oh. I don't want all up on the curb and shit. Anyway. Well, family, I just want to come and talk a little shit and share that with y'all and shit. I'm gone. I'm ready to eat. Let me show y'all what my what my grub and shit look like. Cause nigga, I'm finna park somewhere up under something. And I'm finna get at all this. Hold on. Okay. You said 108? Okay. Have some change right here. Thank you. All right, man. Have a nice day. All right, you too. Yeah. I don't like to just be putting the camera all in people's faces and shit. Motherfuckers don't be liking that shit. Hello. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Uh huh. Yeah, I don't try to put the camera in people's face and shit. Because a lot of places want to want you to, you know, sign a clearance and shit. And some motherfuckers be like, nigga, where, uh, where my money for the movie and all that old type of shit. <laughs> we ain't doing that. So, you know, to keep from going through all them extremes, I try not to even take nobody's face because I don't want to hear all that bullshit about, um, you know, pay me and all that kind of shit. Uh-uh. So, uh. Yeah, nigga, let me let me let let me pull over right quick. Shit, I look real good at pulling over right over here by motherfucking DDs. Shit, nigga. Um, but I got to have my car where I can run a nigga over in case some shit go sideways. So let me back my shit in right here. Yeah, cause I ain't got no problem with running a nigga over. That's nothing. Shit, run that ass right the fuck over. Come out of line. It's no problem. Shit, and I got all my documents right in this motherfucking car. Shit, I got my weed card documents. I got my motherfucking license and registration. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Excuse, 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 excuse. <laughs> okay. Okay, then. Excuse me, shit. Excuse me, shit. I'm fully equipped in this motherfucking shit. Let some shit pop off of this motherfucker. Uh, excuse me, officer. Hold on. Let me get my motherfucking paperwork on that ass. Shit. What'd you say? You finna take me where? Uh, not tonight. Not after I get through showing these motherfucking documents. Shit. I'm going home like a motherfucker. Shit. <laughs> <laughs>